Infernal Shrines. Hey everyone, today we get to play on the Infernal Shrines. I tried the uh, uh, record without draft a couple times. The only feedback I got was to keep the draft, so we're going to go ahead and do that. Uh, looks like the enemy team gets first pick, first ban. And they immediately ban out Mel Gannis. Uh, we should in turn ban out Asmodan. Uh, looks like I'm going to be healer or damage dealer. Interesting. Um, let's see here. Um, what kind of damage dealer do we want to be? Oh, it looks like everyone's in. Hey, everyone. Uh, looks like they're banning out Orphea. Do I want to be a damage dealer or do I want to be a healer? What interests me right now? Um, what does this guy hit play? Mostly assassins and healers, so he's fills the two roles that we need. Oh boy! Tremble before me. I just realized that we were trying to go for a double tank, so... Um... We should be picking up... I was gonna say... Uh, not our soul laner. Because now they can choose whichever soul lane they want, and it's guaranteed... Pretty much guaranteed to lose. Uh, Ragnaros is a... Uh, melee assassin in the soul lane. Um, anyone with uh, pretty good sustain or range just wrecks them. So it kind of sucks, but could be worse things in the world. Um, let's see your. Do we have Maev, Diablo, Brightwing? I haven't played Junkrat in a while. Junkrat is pretty good wave clear from Poke. So I'll show Junkrat. Yeah, white means good. Yeah, I'm, I like Junkrat here. Good wave clear. I can poke the shrines from a safe distance. Keep myself away from Diablo. Um, if my Ev uh, comes in. Yeah, I guess it doesn't really matter what we choose here. I'll lock in Junk Rat. There you go. Uh, the slows we have to help out the Rainer is Murden. Does mine baseline have slows? And roots them denied. for two seconds. No, does not have uh, slows baseline. Alright, so. Tracer. So the reason why I say Lily Rex Tracer and it's, and it's not it's not facetious at all is Tracer will come in to try to do damage to the backline that'd be myself, Lily or Rainer. Uh, she can just hit her Q or not her Q, her uh, E, and that will blind Tracer and then Tracer can't do anything. Uh, yeah, and that's it. 
So it's very much we just have to. Uh, she just has to hold on to her blinds until Tracer comes in, and then Tracer can't do any damage. Prepare yourselves for battle, heroes. Also, um, Why so Ragnaros, oh uh, not Ragnaros, uh, Rainer. He has uh, really good um, auto attack damage. And uh, he can actually kind of chunk her out as she's trying to come in. And the right wing doesn't do great uh, spot healing. So, going to be interesting. We cannot tarry. All right, so I want to put some English on it. So the reason for that, obviously, for the larger range. There we go. There we go, well done. And we are just going to rotate down here to the bottom lane. Make sure we are grabbing this XP. We're going to rotate back up. Try to help out everyone that we can. There we go. Strange. Alright. Rotating back down. Okay. Alright, um, Rainer is getting ganked in the middle lane. There we go, taste for explosion. To try to get our damage up on our Q. Nicely done by the Rainer. You know what, since you got ganked there and it was a one for one, that's exactly what you want. There we go. And I'm just going to rotate back to the bottom lane, grab this XP. We'll throw that there for some vision. There we go. And that is putting pressure down there on the bottom lane. Ragnaros was able to get a kill. Again, just throwing our nicely done by the Ragnaros there, using his molten core right at the right time. Okay. Nicely done. 
Oh, and we lost it barely, but we lost it. Uh, tricky shuffle. It's perfectly fine. Yeah, that was on the Ragnaros there. But with everything, we are still a little bit ahead on XP. And we're going to rotate down, make sure we are grabbing this XP here. go that's all the XP that we could want need or desire and one more I'm just gonna use that to rotate a little safely all right I'm so dead uh, I did not expect him to be in this camp. I thought that uh, Murden rotated here, checked it, and then went up, but he did not. So that's on me. That is very much on me. Well, Ragnaros is getting ample value in the top lane. Please retreat. Okay. But if we were to get that four, I'd say that'd be worth it. Not quite. Okay, we are now going to go with Riptire. There we go, easy. Perfect. Alright, looks like they were able to grab air. Nice CC there by the um, Murden. go and now we can just walk away good or well done by the Ragnaros getting that pressure uh, he did go with lava wave Okay, we're gonna throw our Oh dang, who died? Yeah, let's just back away. Once again, just going for vision. They've already won this. We can just back away. I'm just hoping that Ragnaros does go for the lava wave and try to get something. Okay. All right, that's not bad. It does stop the 
uh, enemy team from getting any kind of value. Uh, it's actually really well done by the Ragnaros. Okay. That uh, that was very painful. Well done. It was good synergy by the um, Maev and the Gul'dan. Go. Getting a little bit more stacks for us. There we go. Just doing that to clear it up a little bit faster. And oh, that sucks that the. Uh, Murden died. Ragnaros once again using his love wave to keep pressure off of our lanes. <laughs> Go. Uh, we should be trying to get all the XP we can. The enemy team has gained. Has gained an XP lead on us. Um, okay, two v one down the bottom. Start rotating up. There. Now we're gonna back all the way out. We have a little bit of an, um, it's a 4v4 here. Level 16 to level... Oh, what are you doing, Rag? Don't go in there. You are way too squishy. Okay. Okay, well, uh, we're now going to go Endless Nades. Okay. I'm just trying to get as many. Oh. 
Man, that's another. The demons have summoned an arcane punisher. Okay, one more. Just to throw it out there. And I'm just gonna back all the way up. How's our damage doing? 43,000. Okay, so we're doing okay. One of our forts has fallen. Reg. Just to keep them back a little bit. We have these heavens of the demon's punisher. Ragnaros, I'm assuming his XP is just doing really great for us. Okay. Just gonna keep rotating here. Your resilience cannot be shaken. Well, that sucked. That was like I even checked the bush and he immediately goes up. I even checked the bush to see if, uh, if they'd actually be there and the Diablo was oh what are you doing just this attack you're dead this attack <laughs> all you can do at that point is just attack do what you can yeah you're definitely dead just don't try to run uh, 54 bonus damage. Our fort is lost. Down three forts. I'm heading back to base. Okay. If I was the enemy team, I'd just be walking away. You got that ultimate from us, or that incredibly long cooldown. This one's a little bit less of a cooldown. Okay. Well, while this is going on, we are doing damage to a keep. We do definitely need 20 before we can move on. Okay. Did they get the keep? No. Well, now we just need to defend this fort. A uh, two seconds left on Ragnaros, six seconds left on... Alright, just did that for some damage at 97%. Alright, we're now gonna go cannonball.
The enemy's punisher has been vanquished. Keep eliminating. Okay, well, we're just kind of sieging up here. Dang. I was hoping to jump to this well, but not quite. Um, they should be able to end here. Instead, it looks like they're trying to go for a double keep. Um, it's here, 8 seconds, 15 seconds. Our core it's going to be uh, interesting. Yep, use your... Well, that's 2 kills. Saved the we saved the core. That's all that matters. Alright. Well done. Another kill. Okay. Nicely done. All right, let's go. What are we doing? I do like the core call. Why are we? Yeah. Uh, we got 25 seconds. to get this score. Who died? Lily? Already? This is probably going to end it. Let's write... No, 44 seconds. Yeah. Yeah, just... Just shoot. Just shoot. Uh, GG. Ugh, I'm not sure why we stopped to get this camp that did absolutely nothing. If we would just gone with the five man top, as the Ragnar said, we would have won. We will fight again. Ugh. Problem is my C damage is absolutely nil. MVP. Absolutely nil. Um no, I would give it to Ragnaros, except for instead of when he was very much dead, he should have just stopped and just done as much damage as he possibly could, but instead he kept trying to run. But I messed up there just as much.
So I had three kills, five assists, four deaths, 136,201 in siege damage, 70,301 in hero damage, 11,453 in XP contribution. Uh, talents we went for today, put some English on it, taste for explosion, tricky shuffle, rip tire, ripper air, endless nades, and finally cannonball. But let me know what you guys think and what we could have done a little bit better, and have a great day.